But I do mm -hmm. love my masochism games. Let it be said. You do, I know you do. You enjoy getting over it. I enjoy right. getting over it, I enjoy Dark Souls. Did you ever get over it? Um, I didn't get farther than the, uh, the, the, like, flight of stairs, because that was just bugging me so much as an obstacle. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. Oh, oh no, I'm not even supposed to go this way. I think. Oh yeah, you could just jump from there to the next platform. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, very carefully timed jumps. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh. <laughs> and you're back there. What if I just lie here? Just lie here and just think about my fate. Think about what brought me to this point and just think better thoughts. Think of better places. Think of the Shire. I could be back in the Shire. I could walk to the Shire right now and we could be done with this instead of climbing this awful tower. But yet we must go on. We must persist. I can hear the Shire. It's coming back to me. Welcome to the next two hours of chuckles and, and sighs. Ah! <laughs> Sometimes with intermittent screaming. Who's the developer for this game? Uh, oh, oh. yeah. Jump Knight, right? Jump. Yeah. Jump King. Jump ah! King. I was wrong. Dude, you are a bunch of humble uh, knights, but soon you will be a king of jump. Uh, Nextly, who's both developer and publisher. This is their only game on Steam. This is, I mean, this is all they're about. <laughs> Nextly exists as Jump King. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny to me being the first game that they ever made because like, like Bennett Foddy did not make uh, like getting over it first. He actually had like a lot of right. other stuff beforehand. God damn it. Yeah. He had some God damn it! Their newest games. <laughs> <laughs> Hot new game dev. We want to bring back magic to video games. Barch, do you feel the magic? I feel the magic in my soul, yo. Newly started Swedish game studio. Whip! Ah. Huh. Oh. Oh my god. Okay, Barch. Be very careful. Oh my god. <laughs> you made it to a new area. The Colossal Drain. But you can definitely still fall all the way back down. <sighs> like that. Like that. Dude, you need someone uh, at all times to have like a towel to, s to wipe sweat from your brow as you play this. <laughs> like you don't have time to take care of, of your bodily needs because you might, you might lose faith if you'd had to take care of all that. <sighs> God. All right, you're getting better. That was a wall, though. No, I'm so doing this on. I'm doing this on purpose. I'm saying it. I'm saying if I can like ricochet myself because that would be safer than like jumping for it on my own. But of course, there there's no way to be safe. No, 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 no. Ricochet at that uh, second jump on this screen. Or no, it would be the third jump. I bet you could ricochet on the third jump on this. Screen. <sighs> Fuck. I'm just gonna have to do it, aren't I? Yeah. You got the first one okay the first time. I spoke too soon. Fuck. Like, Why'd they make this game $13? $13 is a decent price for this, I think. More. Yeah, it's fine. They just I feel like they chose an unlucky number on purpose almost. Oh. I can imagine that being the case. I'm all the way back at the bottom, Whip! <laughs> oh, boy. Like, I can do all this, like, really, really nicely, and I'm getting... I should just shut up. Really should shut up.
But yeah, I'm doing all this like really, really nicely memorizing like the general like rates that things like jump at and how long I have to hold the button and whatnot. I just keep on messing up at this next part. Oh my God. All right, you're back. Uh, this is this is such a tough jump. Let's see that nerve-wracking jump. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. You took a bump on the head, but you did it. Here's another one. And you're back. But it's okay. You're an expert on this jump. See? Expert. <laughs> there is a Jump King Discord server. Yay. I'm it's... so happy I can discuss my failings with others. Ah, I'm forgetting the pressure needed for those small jumps. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> In the sad story of Watch King, as he tries and fails repeatedly. But an ounce of hope in his heart always remains, no matter how much he face plants. <laughs> so goes the tale of Botch the Jump King. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking hell. <sighs> Ooh. That was a fancy save. Fancy save for a fancy Man. man. I can't believe the people who developed this had the nerve to say we want to make games fun again. <laughs> so that second and third jump is pretty ah. down. You got you got some good tricks for getting yourself in the right place there. <gasps> oh, you did it! <sighs> Look at all the moments they programmed into this area just to make you go all the way back to the start of it. Like that. Oh. You got slopes. Oh, I didn't know that was how that was going to work. Oh, fuck. Slopes are evil. <sighs> I'm taking that one too fast. I got to take that one slow. Like, I'm taking all this slow. fast. I'm getting a little bit impatient. I think it shows in my play. <laughs> Take it slow, Barch. The babe will wait for you. The babe she will always be there. Go. He's skull and bones by the time I get up there. <laughs> yeah, that's probably the joke. We, we should guess at what the joke is once you get up top. Because presumably it's it's either going to be a joke or it's going to be real. It's unlikely that it's real. You should take bets on the joke. I'm gonna, I think skull and bones is a pretty good guess. Skull and bones, a dragon, nothing. Yeah, a what? truly fearsome opponent. <laughs> What 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 is funniest? What is funniest really? There could be a note that says out shopping and like maybe you actually have to wait a real time hour for her to come back or something like that. <laughs> you should make one of these with. Oh my god. I could see myself getting pretty evil with it. When I, if I ever did make a game, I'd rather make something fun. Fun. <laughs> Not torturous. Oh my god. You know, one man's torture is another man's fun. I wish there were different sound effects for which part of your body hit the, uh... Um... <laughs> oh, that's a nice save. Which part of your body would hit, uh, the land. Like when your head just clangs on a, uh, platform, it should just be a clang. <laughs> I think you are getting impatient. Yeah. yeah, I'm getting impatient. I'm getting real impatient. It sucks because like the uh, the whole point, I guess, of video games is that you would, as you say, internalize it and know how to do it well every time, so that you could do it fast. But it's gonna be a long trek with a game like this, where there's like no meters, no markings, no indications. I'm just tired of this one jump in the tunnel. Like everything else is fine honestly so i got a question for you if the game were for any reason to suddenly like hand you an easier platform would you be happy about it or would you be upset about it hmm i would actually use 
an assist in this game. I usually swear off assists, but that's because those are usually in easy games. <sighs> if I could just set a platform to be like right next to that red platform that's like on the r left there, so I stop falling through, that would probably be something that I would make use of. Oh god, I'm being- oh, I gotta- mm, I'm just irritated at myself at this point! <laughs> I can do it. It's fine. It's fine. It's totally fine. It's easy. It's easy! Oh. Uh, if you put uh, 20 monkeys in a room with a typewriter, they could beat this game. It might take a billion kajillion years, but they could do it, March. That's how random this works. It's a fact. We determined this through our minds and brains, which are the same thing. <laughs>